Black Sheep Gifts, we opened in 2010. Uh, my father passed away in 2009. The store is actually named after him, so it's Thanks Frank LLC, but we do business as Black Sheep Gifts. So I used his life insurance money to start the business, and we kind of joke that on his side of the family, it's a whole herd of black sheep. Uh, there aren't really any white sheep, a few gray. Um, so it just became apropos to name it Black Sheep Gifts. I love a challenge of having somebody come in and say, I'm looking for a gift for um, a 12 year old boy and I don't know what to get him. I, my favorite thing is, it's, I feel like it's challenge accepted and, and I can come up with five or six items uh, and, and putting personal touches on things. Um, being able to create and curate the, the right gift for, the, for each person. We'd sell a lot of socks. Uh, we have fun socks, we have cozy socks. Um, socks is always big this time of year. We do a lot with puzzles and games. Um, we say we take you cradle to grave, so we have something for everybody. So we, there's not really a specific item, it's just more of groupings. Um, as the holidays roll in, toys and games sell a lot better. Uh, again, food, all of the little items that you pick up for the holidays. The best part of owning a local business is the connection to your community. Um, the community is so supportive. Here in Irvington, they, we have a great neighborhood and a great group of people. Uh, that's probably my favorite thing about owning a small business is feeling connected to the community. I keep thinking that what I really want is the next generation to bring their kids through Irvington and say, oh, I remember there used to be this gift shop there and the lady had candy and, you know, she would give us a piece sometimes and things like that. So it's really about being part of the neighborhood.